all about the clap back. Get your boss whack, premieres funeral on Snapchat. Ha! You now tuned into the bad guy. What's good, y'all? Fist Vegas, the hardest voice of sports. Go ahead, hit that like button and subscribe to the Fisk. You know why you at it. Y'all know what time it is. If you ain't with it, you best get with it. Now let's rock. Listen. Shout out to Montrez Harrow, baby. <laughs> Shout out. Shout out to Montrez Harrell. <laughs> Yo, my man Montrez said I need to go to the winning side, man. This man switched up. <laughs> my man Montrez Hell said fuck the Clippers, man. <laughs> he said I ain't got time for this, bro. Yo. He switched sides, man. Oh my goodness, yo. Yo, this is dope. He switched sides, man. This man said, this man said, I ain't with it. Yo, you know that meme of Magic Johnson on the internet? Remember when, remember when Magic Johnson stepped down from the Lakers as the as the uh, president? And he had that, nope, not me, me. That's, that's Montrez Harrell looking at the Clippers. Clippers are like, man, we're going to get the Lakers next season, man. Wait till next season start. That nigga Montrez is like, nope, not me. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Yo, shout out to my man, Little Finger, Rob Palenka, okay? If you don't watch Game of Thrones, you ain't going to understand. But we, us Game of Thrones fans, we like to call Rob Palenka Little Finger, okay? Now, the, the man make it move. All right, all jokes aside, I had to get my laugh off. You know, I can't wait to hear Skip Bayless. Ooh, I can't wait to hear Skip Bayless cry about this. If Kawhi Leonard was so great, if Kawhi Leonard was all this and all that, why Montrez here go to the Lakers? If the Clippers is everything y'all say they are, you know, I, I, Kawhi Leonard and Paul George, they, they, supposed to, they were supposed to be the, this generation's Jordan and Pippen. That's what y'all told me. Ooh, why he switched sides? Why he ain't stay with a better team? Why he go to the Lakers? <laughs> I love it. Yo, yo, dudes is happy. Yo, the Lakers, uh, uh, they lost to White Howard. They lost to White Howard. The Lakers is falling. Nigga, please. Who cares about Ronda? We got Schroeder. Who cares about Danny Green? We got Wes Matthews. Who cares about Dwight Howard? We just got Montrez Harrell. The Lakers just got younger, faster, and more explosive. Watch it back. They're going to repeat. It's a wrap. Give up. If you're a Laker hater, if you're a LeBron hater, just just, just, just take the red pill. All right, just take the red fist unit pill. More, uh, look, bro. Take that red pill. Stop taking the blue pill. You know what I'm saying? Because I know that hurt. I know LeBron haters was mad last month when Bron took that chip home. You know he about to repeat, right? Just go ahead and take that red pill. Accept the fate now. Just take that dose of reality now, please. Alright, when Morpheus Fist extends his hand, you take it. You don't bite it. Alright, just take that red pill. The Lakers are going to repeat, and there ain't a damn thing anybody in the NBA can do about it. Just take it. Alright, they're not sending James Harden to Brooklyn. So ain't gonna be no super team in Brooklyn to take down the mighty Lakers. Every team got two superstars. And I promise you, yes, your two ain't better than mine. So just take it. Just accept it. Accept your fate. You know what I'm saying? Just accept your fate. Just bend the knee. Bend the knee. That's all you gotta do. Just bend the knee. That's all. Don't fight it. Don't make it harder than it needs to be. I don't wanna have to like it's like when Daenerys Targaryen come through your city or she come through your village. Just bend the knee so I ain't got to burn your brother or burn your son or burn your uncle. Just bend the knee. I, LeBron and AD don't want to have to burn down your village. Just bend the knee and keep it pushing. All right? it's just, LeBron is the king of the NBA. 
he his reign of terror has no end this man LeBron James is still in the middle of his prime he gets better he ain't even slowing down yet he can still dunk he can still play 45 minutes a game he's no sign of aggression none and now he's getting a team of young cats behind him, Dennis Schroeder, Wes Matthews, uh, freaking Montrez Harrell. And guess what? The Kuzma tree that's going to get them a, a, a third all-star, it's coming. It's coming. I don't think I understand, man. The Lakers are taking over this shit. You feel me? The Lakers are taking over the NBA the way Beans took over Philly and State property. You understand me? You either get down or you lay down. When you lay down, you're going to stay there. You understand? You cross LeBron James path the wrong way, you getting smoked out here. I ain't no more Golden State Warriors to, 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 to save you niggas. You, you LeBron James hating niggas. Ain't no more Golden State for y'all. Alright? The NBA is officially the National LeBron James Association. It's the NLJA. That's what it is. It ain't the NBA no more. It's the NLJA. The National LeBron James Association. And when you go to the La Finals, you get bounced in five to six games. That's the vibes. Bottom line, point blank, period. End the discussion. I don't, you know, like for real. I don't know how else to tell you that. And I don't want to tell it to you no other way. It's not over. It's not over. It's not. The Kuzma trade is coming. They're going to get another star. That's that's what y'all don't understand. Like, it's, it's not over. It's not. Y'all thought it was funny. Y'all thought it was all cute when LeBron James came to LA and Lonzo Ball stunk. Brandon Ingle stunk. Kyle Kuzma stunk. And LeBron James got hurt. Y'all thought shit was sweet. Y'all was like, man, this dude LeBron James, man. He trying to be Michael B. Jordan. Oh, LeBron James is wash. He's the wash king. Y'all scared now. Y'all sick. Y'all wake up every day as basketball fans. I get mad when y'all see my man LeBron James out here balling. I get mad when y'all see my man LeBron James out here team getting stronger. Y'all get mad. And I and I understand. I do. It's like it's really the equivalent of like John Cena. Like, LeBron James, is, he really is the John Cena of, of basketball. Like, his run don't end. And, you know, like, if you look at The Rock, The Rock had, like, a, a four-year run from, like, 98 to, like, 02. Rock had, like, a four-year run. Stone Cold had, like, a, a three-year run from, like, 97 to, like, 2000, if that. You know what I'm saying? My man, John Cena, dominated the entire WWE from 2004 all the way to like 2017 he had like a 13 year run and that's what LeBron is doing LeBron James prime is the longest prime in NBA history longer than Kareem longer than uh, that other nigga that played in Utah with the baby mama drama um, Karl Malone longer than all that I love it. Shout out to Montrez Harrell. Clippers, y'all gonna click. Montrez Harrell tired of looking, tired, tired of being a stepchild. He tired of being a foster kid in Staples Center. He finally came home. <laughs> hey, Kawhi, that could have been you. But you wanted to be a Clipper. <laughs> I ain't got nothing else to say. That's it, that's all. Subscribe to the unit if you rockin' with me. My name is Fist Vegas, and I approve this message.